Hi, welcome to Grandpa's World. I'm Laura. I'm Ashlyn. Okay. <laughs> and today we are going to be reading stories from California about UFOs and aliens. Ooh, spooky. Okay, so in 1967 in the Azusa Canyon, California, William and Harry were camping out under the stars. It was a beautiful starlit sky. The boys got into their sleeping bags. They lay there looking at the stars, talking about how much fun they had had that day, wading, swimming, and hiking. It had been a fun-filled day. Harry noticed it first, then William right after. It was so strange. There was a bright star. It was so far away, it looked like it had something else to do it, to it, and yet it seemed like we could see it. This star-like object seemed to be knocking other stars out of its way, making a big hole in the sky. We talk about this often. William is now 60 years old and has never found anyone else who has seen anything as he has. Second story. Henrietta lived on a 100-acre farm in 1970. One fine day, she opened her door to go outside and instead stopped and very gently closed it. She picked up the phone and called Fred. She told him about wanting to go outside, but how when she opened the door, she saw three small green men in an aircraft in her front yard. Now it was 3 a.m. when she called Fred, so he got in his truck and went over to her house. When Fred pulled up into the drive, he didn't see any UFOs, but there was a big round burnt spot on her lawn. They also left some green slime type of liquid leading to the barn. Fred put some of it into a, car, into a jar and took it to the Air Force Base and never saw or heard of anything about it. And those are the two stories for today so like subscribe click the notification bell and have a wonderful day